A lot of ceramic coatings are hydrophobic, and what this means is it creates a lot of surface tension and it causes the water to bead up in tight little tiny beads. And that looks cool. We all love how water beading looks on a car. The problem is, is if you're not around to wipe that water off and the sun comes out and dries it, you risk having water spots. And if there's something corrosive in the water, instead of just leaving a mineral deposit on the surface like you saw with the Mercedes Benz, it's going to leave an imprint ring in the paint that you're going to have to polish off. Off. So another option instead of a hydrophobic ceramic coating is a hydrophilic, one that causes the water to sheet, not beat up, but just lay flat and sheet off. Now it doesn't look as cool. You know, I never see anybody sharing pictures on Facebook or Instagram of water sheeting. It's only pictures of water beading. So yeah, it doesn't look as cool, but I tell you, in my experience of detailing cars, and I probably used the machine polisher my first time in the early 1980s, so that's a long time I've been machine polishing. One of the most dreaded paint defects I'm asked to remove are water spots, because usually they're all over the whole car, and if they don't wipe off, that means I gotta polish the entire car. So. If you're thinking about a ceramic coating, one of the things you may consider is if you live in a place where your car is outside all the time, okay, so it's gonna get rained on, maybe hit by a sprinkler, is instead of choosing a hydrophobic coating, consider a hydrophilic coating, something that causes water to sheet off. And at Dr. Beasley's, we make a number of these, and there's other reputable companies that do this also.